What's happening traders, Alex here and today I'll show you guys the different way of funding your IBKR account. So if you're about to open an account or you just open an account and you need to fund it, this video is going to be really helpful for you. And if you do enjoy it, like and subscribe. And also all the tools that I'm using to day trade will be linked in the description. So if you're looking for a broker, scanner, charts or newsfeed, everything will be linked down below. So let's not waste any more time. Let's jump right in. All right. So the first thing we're going to do is head over the website and click on home. When you're on home, you're going to have these three buttons over here. So you're going to have deposit withdraw and more so we're going to click on deposit so when you're on this page the first thing you're going to want to do is make sure that you are on the currency of your country if you're located in canada make sure you're in canadian if you're in the us make sure you're in us because it's going to change the funding method so if we go to the first section we have connect your bank via eft this is the setup that i'm currently using to fund my account or add funds if i need to the way it works is you connect your bank account to your ib care account and you're going to execute a withdraw from your account so it's going to be like you're sending an e-transfer but they're going to do it by themselves so for an example if i click connect over here it's going to bring us to this page and it's going to give us a bit more detail so when you're creating this type of funding method it's going to take a couple days just to get set up because when you do this you have to fill up your bank account information over here so it's going to be a checking account that you have your bank account number confirmation bank account number so what they're going to do is they're going to send a very small deposit to your account and you're going to have to come back to your ibkr account to confirm the amount that they deposit the reason they're doing this is to make sure that it is your account before they try to withdraw a certain amount from this specific account so after you registered your account for eft transfers it's going to bring you to this page and over here the only thing you're going to need to do is just enter the amount you want to deposit and say create deposit and it's going to bring you to this page where you just need to confirm the deposit and it's going to be in your trading account within four to five business day so this funding method takes a lot of time because you need to get it registered and after you create your deposit so the whole process is going to take about seven to ten business day so if you want to have a faster method you're going to have to do a wire transfer and i'll show you guys the instruction or the way that i have it set up so if we go back to the main page we can see the second option which is the bank wire and this is going to take about a day to get in your account so if you need funds right away or if you get a margin call this is the way you're going to be wanted to fund your account because it's going to be way faster the disadvantage of this is of course that there's fee to bank wire transfer compared to the eft which has no fee so over here we can see that banks are only one day to get in your account we're going to do get your instruction and it's going to bring you to this page where you just need to register your bank and after that create a deposit and say get wire instruction and it's going to create you a printable version of all the information you need to send the wire transfer you can bring this sheet to your bank or if you're able to do wire transfer directly from your account all the account information for ibkr are going to be on this paper the good thing is it notifies them of the amount you're sending with your account number so they can match the two deposit together pretty quickly and normally all your funds are going to be available right away to trade so for myself every time i did use a wire transfer the funds were available to trade within one business day which was really quick compared to the eft deposit method so it's all going to be about fees and time if you're looking for cost effective version use eft if you need the funds right away and you don't mind the fee use a bank wire transfer it's going to be way faster so i hope you enjoyed this video if you did like and subscribe let me know what you want to see next.